Hello, welcome to Informatica Enterprise Streaming Data Management videos. Today we will see how Informatica's Enterprise Streaming Data Management solution supports Azure ecosystem. I am Vishwa Belur, I am the product manager for uh, Informatica Streaming Solutions. Informatica has since Reason Act framework for streaming data management. As you can see, we have Edge Data Streaming product which can read data from sensors, machines, web logs, and social media and ingest that into a message hub. Similarly, we have Power Exchange CDC Publisher which captures chain data from relational systems and then puts it onto a message hub. Then Big Data Streaming can process the messages or events in Message Hub with the power of Spark Streaming to enrich and analyze on the data as it goes through the pipe. Big Data Streaming can also process the data onto Hadoop or Cloud Data Lake or relational systems or it can write to a real-time dashboard or trigger an alert for real-time offers or even trigger uh, business processes. So you can see how Informatica handles stream data management with Sense Reason Act framework. Now let's look at the support for streaming data management in, in Azure Cloud. With Edge Data Streaming 2.4, you could ingest streaming data from your streaming devices onto Azure Cloud. And we support Azure Event Hub as a target of EDS data flow so that you can ingest data from streaming sources into Azure Event Hub. From a big data streaming perspective, in 10.2.1, we support streaming data integration in Azure Cloud. So what that means is you could consume streaming data from Azure Event Hub, which is persisted by Edge Data Streaming or otherwise, and then perform in-stream processing and enrichment on, on the data in Azure Cloud with Spark as the engine. Uh, we could also persist streaming data after the analysis onto ADLS and Azure SQL for further analysis or uh, data lake use cases. Here is how the end-to-end -end solution looks like with, with Azure Cloud. So you have the data coming from streaming and IoT sources, which is ingested by EDS into Azure Event Hub. And then the big data streaming processes that within Azure Cloud, HD Insight or Cloud or Hortonworks cluster, and then and do the in-flight in enrichments or in-flight processing of the, of the data as it goes through the pipe and process that into Azure Data Lake or SQL Azure for either data lake purposes or real-time visualization and querying purposes. So the data that's stored in Data Lake can be used for the batch analytics in case in Medica Big Data Management Solution. Now, let's look at a quick demo of Edge Data Streaming and Big Data Streaming working together to ingest and process streaming data in Azure Cloud. First, let's look at the Edge Data Streaming user interface where you would ingest data from weblog into Azure. So if you click on the, the properties of weblog source, you would see the file from where the, the weblogs are being read from. And then if you click on Event Hub, you would see the parameters of Event Hub that you have configured. And when you click on this Deploy button, the data flow gets deployed on the on the Edge device and it will start pushing the data from the weblog into Azure Event. You could also apply simple transformations on the weblog source before the data moves into Event Hub. Now the data is ingested into Azure Event Hub by Edge Data Streaming. Now let's look at how Big Data Streaming can process the data in real time using the, the transformations that are available. You would see that the Azure Event Hub source, which is being read by weblog, is being used as an input to Big Data Streaming mapping. If you look at data object, you would see that it is the Azure Event Hub source. And then you could also look at the type of columns that are available in the data that's coming in. So what we have done here is we have applied simple expression transformation on the data to combine the first name, last name of the employee to give the complete name. And then applied filter on department name column to filter out only those records for the employees who are belonging to the research department. And then pushing the data into Azure Data Lake for data lake purposes. 
You could also note that there are a lot of other transformations that are available here that you could apply as a part of your big data streaming mapping. You could do an aggregation on the data or you could even run machine learning algorithms using the Python transformation that is available as part of big data streaming 10 to 1. In summary, Informatica enables customers to ingest, process, and act on streaming data in Azure Cloud without hand coding. Informatica Edge Data Streaming enables customers to ingest streaming data onto Azure Cloud, whereas Informatica Big Data Streaming enables customers to process and enrich the streaming data in Azure Cloud with the power of Spark. Thank you.